UC Davis researchers reveal eye-opening new clues into autism. Research shows a surprising link between where mom and dad work and the risk of autism in their children. Yeah, pretty fascinating here. Tonight we're getting answers on what kinds of jobs could make childhood autism more severe. From farm workers to doctors and auto mechanics, new UC Davis research is showing some parents' jobs could have an impact on autism disorders in their children. There does seem to be a number of connections from different types of occupational exposures that people would be getting through just doing their regular job. UC Davis's Environmental Health Sciences Director says research shows a parent's exposure to workplace chemicals during fetal development can impact the severity of autism. More than a dozen factors were studied, including people who work with pesticides, cleaning agents, and pharmaceuticals. But the biggest impact was seen in parents who work around plastics. That turned out to be uh, a, a pretty strong set of uh, associations with multiple behavioral outcomes, things like hyperactivity and also how well their language is. The study found that both a mother's and father's jobs could impact their children's cognitive disorders. The time frame they looked at was between three months before pregnancy to birth. If it's part of your job, it may be hard to avoid the exposures, but these are things that could be brought to your supervisor, maybe they could get assigned to a job that's in different part of the, the place, their workplace, where they would be less exposed. Increasing use of protective gear could also help. Maybe you could wear a mask or gloves. Federal occupational health experts participated in the research, and the results could one day lead to new regulations making workplaces safer for expecting parents. I think for employers, there's a message here. More than 500 families were involved in that study. Scientists say there now needs to be more research into how chemical exposure could affect fetal development.